joint pain. That constant ache that lingers in your knees, hips, back, it slows you down, makes every move a chore. You're not alone, you know. Millions suffer in silence, feeling the burn of inflammation with every step. It's a modern epidemic, this creeping stiffness. We work too hard, move too little, and our joints pay the price. You've seen it, I'm sure. The slow shuffle, the wincing smiles, the way people your age are suddenly moving like, well, like they've aged decades overnight. But it doesn't have to be this way. We've been conditioned to believe that joint pain is just a fact of life, a one-way street to creaky bones and limited mobility. Now, I'm not talking about miracle cures or magic potions. This isn't about masking the problem. This is about addressing the root cause, about giving your body the tools it needs to repair, rebuild, and rejuvenate those tired, aching joints. I'm going to delve deep into the science, explore the incredible healing power of nature, and unlock the secrets to long-lasting joint health. Imagine waking up without that familiar stiffness, moving freely without a second thought, enjoying activities you'd long given up on. Picture yourself 15 years from now, still sprightly, still active, still living life on your own terms. This isn't a fantasy, my friends. It's entirely achievable. Over the next few minutes, I'm going to share with you the surprisingly fast relief methods that could transform your life. I'm going to talk about simple changes you can make today, starting right now, to reclaim your mobility and banish joint pain for good. I'll explore the power of targeted nutrition, uncovering the foods that fuel joint health and the ones that silently sabotage it. You'll discover how specific exercises can strengthen the muscles that support your joints, improving flexibility and easing pain. And I'll delve into the world of natural remedies, unlocking the healing potential hidden within your own home. This isn't just about feeling better, it's about living better. It's about regaining your independence, your confidence, your zest for life. It's about saying goodbye to limitations and hello to possibility. Are you ready to feel the difference, to break free from the chains of joint pain and embrace a future filled with movement, vitality and joy? Then stick around. Let's embark on this journey together, a journey towards lasting relief and a life free from the constraints of aching joints. The first step, it's as simple as hitting that play button. Now let's talk about what you put into your body. You wouldn't put cheap petrol in a high-performance car, would you? The same goes for your joints. They need the right fuel to function at their best. And that, my friends, starts with your diet. We've all heard the saying, you are what you eat. Well, when it comes to joint health, it's truer than you might think. The foods we consume can either fuel inflammation, exacerbating pain and stiffness, or they can actively combat it, promoting healing and rejuvenation from the inside out. For years, we've been bombarded with conflicting information about what constitutes a healthy diet. Low fat, high carb, paleo, keto, the list goes on. But when it comes to joint health, there are some clear winners and losers. First and foremost, we need to tackle inflammation, the root cause of so much joint pain. And the best way to do that? By harnessing the power of nature's pharmacy food. Think of your plate as a weapon against inflammation. Each ingredient carefully chosen for its healing properties. Load up on colourful fruits and vegetables, bursting with antioxidants that fight those nasty free radicals wreaking havoc in your joints. Berries in particular are packed with anti-inflammatory compounds. So indulge in those blueberries, strawberries and raspberries. Oily fish like salmon, mackerel and sardines are your new best friends. They're brimming with omega-3 fatty acids clinically proven to reduce inflammation and ease joint pain. Aim for at least two servings a week and your joints will thank you. Now, alongside fighting inflammation, we need to give our bodies the building blocks to repair and strengthen those joints. Think of it like renovating a house. You need the right materials to create a strong and stable structure. Collagen, my friends, is the magic word. 
It's the most abundant protein in our bodies, the glue that holds everything together, including our joints. As we age, collagen production naturally declines, leading to weaker cartilage and increased joint pain. But fear not, we can boost our collagen intake through our diet. I know that you find this video informative so far and will continue to find the rest of this video informational and very educational. So go ahead and give me some support. This is simple, easy and free of cost, but significantly very important. It will only take a few seconds of your time. And like I mentioned before, it will cost you nothing, but will help to grow my channel and also enable me to spread more valuable needed information like this. Now, click on that thumbs up button. It's a simple act, but the impact can be massive. Imagine that simple click as a ripple in a pond, extending outwards to touch and influence others to become more conscious about becoming more informed about their health and well-being. It also helps to spread much-needed important information to a wider audience, which can potentially make a change in someone's life. So, go ahead, show your appreciation for these types of informative videos. Click that thumbs up button to potentially make a change. Now, to ensure that you don't miss out on any more valuable content, click the subscribe button and the notification bell that is beside it, then select all to gain access to all the other videos on my channel and to stay up to date with any new ones that gets posted. Most importantly, subscribing is absolutely free. My channel isn't just about sharing, it's about building a community of knowledge seekers who understand the importance of staying informed and updated when it comes to a healthy lifestyle. Bone broth made by simmering bones, tendons and ligaments is a collagen powerhouse. Add it to soups, stews or simply sip on a warm mug for a soothing and joint nourishing treat. Now you might think that exercising with achy joints is counterintuitive like poking a bruise. But trust me on this my friends, movement is medicine. It's the key to unlocking those stiff joints, lubricating them from the inside out. Think of it like this, a rusty hinge needs a good wiggle to get moving smoothly again, doesn't it? The trick is to choose exercises that strengthen the muscles surrounding your joints, providing support and stability without putting undue stress on the joints themselves. We're not talking about marathon running or heavy weightlifting here. Gentle, low-impact exercises are your best allies in the fight against joint pain. And the beauty of it is, you don't need a fancy gym membership or expensive equipment. You can do these exercises right at home, in your own time, at your own pace. Remember, consistency is key. Even a few minutes each day can make a world of difference. Some gentle giants of the exercise world are yoga and tai chi. These ancient practices have been promoting flexibility and balance for centuries, and for good reason. They're like a soothing balm for your joints, gently stretching and strengthening them through a series of flowing movements. Yoga poses like Warrior II, Triangle and Downward Facing Dog are particularly beneficial for hip and knee pain, improving range of motion and building strength in the surrounding muscles. Tai Chi, with its slow, meditative movements, is excellent for improving balance and coordination, reducing the risk of falls, which are a common concern as we age. And the best part? These practices are not just good for your body, but for your mind, too. They encourage mindfulness, reducing stress, and promoting a sense of calm and well-being, which can further alleviate pain. Now, if yoga and Tai Chi aren't your cup of tea, don't worry. There are plenty of other low-impact exercises that can work wonders for your joints. Swimming, for instance, is like a full-body massage for your joints. The buoyancy of the water supports your weight, allowing you to move freely without putting pressure on your joints. Cycling is another great option, whether it's a leisurely ride through the park or a more vigorous spin class. The circular motion of pedaling is gentle on the knees, and you can adjust the resistance to suit your fitness level. And remember, walking that simplest of exercises is incredibly beneficial. The key is to find activities you enjoy that fit into your daily routine and that you can stick with long term. Remember, consistency is key. So put on some comfortable shoes, crank up your favorite tunes and get moving.
Now let's talk about harnessing the power of nature's medicine cabinet, your kitchen cupboard. Yes, you heard that right. Some of the most potent remedies for joint pain are probably sitting in your pantry right now, just waiting to be discovered. These natural wonders have been used for centuries to soothe inflammation, reduce pain and promote healing, all without the nasty side effects of many conventional medications. Take turmeric, for example. This vibrant yellow spice, a staple in Indian cuisine, contains a powerful compound called curcumin, a potent anti-inflammatory that rivals some prescription medications in its effectiveness. Studies have shown that curcumin can significantly reduce joint pain and stiffness in people with osteoarthritis. Sprinkle it liberally on your food, add it to smoothies, or brew yourself a comforting cup of turmeric latte. Then there is ginger, another culinary hero with a long history of medicinal use. Ginger contains gingerol, a compound with potent anti-inflammatory and analgesic properties, meaning it can help reduce both inflammation and pain. Add fresh ginger to your stir fries, brew a soothing ginger tea, or take ginger supplements for a concentrated dose of its healing power. Now, let's talk about the power of temperature therapy. Sometimes all your aching joints need is a little heat or cold to ease the pain and stiffness. Heat therapy, like applying a warm compress or taking a long soak in a hot bath, can work wonders for stiff, achy joints. The heat helps to relax muscles, increase blood flow to the affected area and reduce pain signals. For a more targeted approach, try using a hot water bottle wrapped in a towel or invest in a heating pad that provides adjustable heat settings. A warm bath infused with Epsom salts is another excellent option. Epsom salts are rich in magnesium, a mineral that can be absorbed through the skin to help relax muscles and reduce inflammation. Light some candles, add a few drops of your favourite essential oil and let the warm water work its magic. Remember, heat therapy is generally best for chronic pain or stiffness rather than acute injuries. If you've recently sprained or strained a joint, it's best to avoid heat in the initial stages of healing. On the flip side, cold therapy can be incredibly effective for acute injuries, like sprains or strains, as well as for flare-ups of inflammatory conditions like arthritis. Applying cold to the affected area helps to constrict blood vessels, reducing swelling and inflammation. It also numbs the area, providing temporary pain relief. A bag of frozen peas wrapped in a tea towel makes an excellent DIY ice pack. Alternatively, you can use a reusable ice pack or even just run cold water over the affected area for a few minutes. Apply cold therapy for 15 to 20 minutes at a time, several times a day, for optimal results. Remember, always listen to your body and stop if you experience any discomfort or increased pain. And if you have any underlying health conditions, it's always wise to check with your doctor before using heat or cold therapy. Do not underestimate the power of touch. A gentle massage can work wonders for aching joints, easing muscle tension, improving circulation, and promoting relaxation. Enlist the help of a willing partner or treat yourself to a professional massage by a qualified therapist. If you're massaging yourself, use warm oil or lotion and gentle circular motions, focusing on the muscles surrounding the affected joint. Another option is to try acupressure, an ancient Chinese healing technique that involves applying pressure to specific points on the body to stimulate energy flow and promote healing. Acupressure has been shown to be effective in reducing pain and improving function in people with osteoarthritis. You can find acupressure charts online or in books that show you the specific points to target for joint pain. Apply firm, sustained pressure to each point for a few minutes using your fingers, thumbs or a massage tool. As with any complementary therapy, it's always a good idea to consult with a qualified practitioner before trying acupressure at home. Now, we've explored a holistic approach to banishing joint pain and reclaiming your mobility. From the food on your plate to the ancient wisdom of natural remedies, but the journey to lasting relief doesn't end there. It's about making subtle yet significant changes to your lifestyle, changes that support your joints and keep you moving with ease for years to come. 
It's easy to think of our health as a series of isolated compartments, diet, exercise, medication. But the truth is, it's all interconnected. Our bodies are complex ecosystems, and every choice we make, every action we take, has a ripple effect throughout this intricate system. So beyond the pills and potions, beyond the targeted exercises and carefully chosen foods, lie the often overlooked aspects of our daily lives that can make all the difference. It's about tuning into your body's signals, understanding its language, and responding with care and respect. Let's now talk about ergonomics for a moment, shall we? Now, before you switch off thinking this is just about fancy office chairs and complicated computer setups, hear me out. Ergonomics is simply the science of designing your environment to fit your body rather than the other way around. And it plays a crucial role in preventing and alleviating joint pain. Think about how you sit, how you stand, how you move throughout your day. Are you hunched over your phone, your neck craned at an unnatural angle? Are you lifting heavy objects with your back, putting undue stress on your spine? These seemingly small, repetitive actions can have a cumulative effect on our joints over time, leading to pain, stiffness and even injury. So, what can we do about it? Start by becoming aware of your posture. Stand tall, shoulders relaxed, ears aligned with your shoulders and your chin slightly tucked. When sitting, choose a chair that supports your lower back and allows your feet to rest flat on the floor. And when lifting heavy objects, bend your knees, not your back, and engage your core muscles to protect your spine. Now, I know what you must be thinking. All this talk of posture and ergonomics sounds like hard work, but I assure you, it's not about becoming a slave to perfect alignment or obsessing over every movement. It's about making small, sustainable changes that become second nature over time. Think of it as a form of self-care, a way of showing your joints some love and appreciation for all they do for you. Just like you wouldn't drive your car on empty, neglecting regular maintenance, treat your body with the same respect. And most importantly, listen to your body. It's constantly communicating with you, sending subtle signals to let you know what it needs. Don't ignore those aches and pains, those twinges of discomfort. They're not signs of weakness, but rather valuable messages from your body asking for your attention. There you have it. The blueprint to reclaiming your mobility, banishing joint pain, and embracing a future filled with vitality and joy. We've journeyed from the depths of inflammation to the power of nature's healing touch, from the importance of movement to the often overlooked wisdom of simply listening to your body. Remember that feeling of despair, that sense of inevitability that joint pain was just a fact of life, a one-way street to creaky bones and limited living? Well, I hope that by now you see things differently. You have the power to change your story, to rewrite the narrative of your health. This isn't about quick fixes or miracle cures. It's about making sustainable changes, embracing a holistic approach that nourishes your body from the inside out. It's about taking charge of your health, becoming the architect of your own well-being. And the best part is, these changes, these choices you make for your joints, they have a ripple effect throughout your entire being. As you nourish your body with anti-inflammatory foods, you're also supporting your heart, your brain, your overall vitality. As you move your body with intention, building strength and flexibility, you're boosting your mood, sharpening your mind and increasing your energy levels. Imagine yourself 15 years from now. What will your life look like if you continue down the same path, ignoring the whispers of your aching joints? Now imagine a different future, one where you took action, embraced these changes and reclaimed your mobility. Which vision fills you with more joy, more excitement, more hope? The choice is yours. The power to transform your health, to live a life free from the limitations of joint pain, lies within you. So, what are you waiting for? Don't let another day go by feeling stiff, achy and held back by your joints. Start today, right now, by incorporating just one of these tips into your daily routine. 
drink a cup of turmeric tea, go for a walk in nature, do some gentle stretches before bed. Small steps taken consistently can lead to remarkable transformations. And remember, you're not alone on this journey. Share your progress, your challenges and your triumphs in the comments below. Let's create a community of support, a movement of people reclaiming their mobility and embracing a future filled with vitality and joy. The information provided in this video is intended for educational and informational purposes only. It is not intended as a substitute for professional medical advice, diagnosis or treatment. Always consult with a healthcare professional or a registered dietitian before starting any new diet or making significant changes to your eating habits or lifestyle, especially if you have underlying health conditions. Your health is your most significant asset and it's crucial to make informed decisions under the guidance of professionals. Remember, there isn't a one-size-fits-all solution to health, and what works for one person may not work for another. Therefore, work with your healthcare provider to make the best decisions for your health. Use this information as a starting point. Thanks for tuning in. Remember, take action today for a healthier tomorrow. And in the meantime, keep an eye out for my next upcoming video, but until my next video, click on the playlist that is displayed at the end of this video for more informational and educational videos like this. Also, stay healthy, stay happy and keep learning.